The Sandbox Bonus Tools from CADMAN extend the functionality of the Sandbox Tools. The Foam Core Tool does successive push-pull operations on selected faces, incrementing each following push-pull by the given increment distance. You can also set the distance to a negative distance and create successive decreasing contour levels. Selecting these contour levels, the standard From Contours tool creates a triangulated surface mesh, but often surfaces made this way do not sculpt well using the Smoover tool. This is because the surface is a series of elongated triangular shards, and there's not enough vertex information for good behavior of the Smoover tool. The Add Detail tool simply makes smaller, long, narrow shards. The Project Mesh Sandbox Bonus tool projects a regular grid onto a selection, giving more regular vertex points to the Smoover tool from which to operate. The result is more control while modifying the surface. Once you have sculpted a new terrain surface, the Hula Hoop Bonus Sandbox tool creates contours from a selection. These lines can be given to an engineer for accurate terrain analysis, grading plans, and you can even create a new triangulated mesh if you want. Once you have a surface drape, your 2D arrangements of planting materials can come to life by dropping them onto the terrain using the Drop Downward Sandbox Bonus Tool. The Drop Downward Tool places each item onto the model without successive drops interfering with others, resulting in a one-step drop process of a selection of multiple plants with multiple internal overlapping leaves and surfaces. Use the Set to Elevation Sandbox Bonus Tool to move a selection of objects off a terrain surface to a uniform elevation to allow easier layout on a flat plane. The Sandbox Bonus Tools from CADMAN make working with terrain more fun and interactive throughout the entire design process.